Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. This is the final video of the Spear Gun Trigger Mechanism project. Today I will combine all the parts together into the final assembly, but before that there's a couple more parts to do. The spacers and the pins that hold everything inside the housing. So let's take a look how I do it. I need some spacers to keep the trigger and the sear center inside the housing. For that I'll use this piece of nylon. It's a low friction material and very tough. First I machine the thickness, then I drill some holes slightly bigger than what the shaft diameter will be. Then I cut all the small pieces. I cut and drilled all the spacers. Now I'll sandwich them together with a 5mm screw. And I put it on the drill press machine and turn the outside diameter to 8.5mm. There's some of the pins that hold the sear inside the housing. I first cut it with a hacksaw, grind it to size with the belt sander, and then I polish it to look like this. There's a warning label right there, and it says, for your own safety, do not grind your fingers, only the pins. And now to polish the end of the pins, I have a block with uh, 400 grit and paper. And it's done. And there's all the parts ready for assembly. You got the housing, the triggers, the sear, spring, some spacers and some pins. Next I'm gonna put all of this together and show the final result. I'm gonna start putting all of this together. First I'm gonna put one spacer.
it helps to put a little bit of oil because it keeps the spacer from moving around too much and now I slide everything inside now I put the pin, this is the 4mm pin I'll do the same thing for the sear And now the last thing will be the spring. And there's the final result. Two beautiful homemade spear gun trigger mechanisms. Got the first trigger mounted on this piece of wood. Let's take a look at this. Engaged and fire. <laughs> There's the second trigger. That's the one made from the square tubing. Welcome back. Wow, I don't know what to say, but I'm very happy with the final results. I gotta find some fine wood and start making the spear again itself. But for now, I gotta say thanks for watching my videos once again. Leave a comment, please subscribe. It will mean a lot to me. It will encourage me to make more videos like this one. Bye-bye.